know nothing about this. Y'all don't know nothing about this, honey. Yes. What? Bring it. Okay, girl. Treating me kind. Sweetness for me. Carry me through. What? Oh, yeah, skipping, y'all. about Mariah Carey okay I'm not talking about the Mariah Carey who's vocally challenged like you younger generation folks like to bring up I'm talking about the Mariah Carey who could sing her asshole off do you hear me the clarity right next to Whitney Houston two distinct voices she is a legend she's earned her title she's shady as fuck <laughs> nonchalant as fuck don't care <laughs> about nobody or nothing and today <laughs> we're gonna do a reading on her and Nick Cannon okay and see what's going on in their <laughs> relationship no matter what y'all say Mariah Carey is one of the best singers in history she's not the best but she's she's pretty much up there with the big dogs with like Michael Jackson, Whitney Houston, like people talk about who is it? Danny Levito or and then Ariana Grande. I mean, Ariana Grande is cute and shit, but it's like no. Like Mariah Carey used to be the her and Whitney Houston. But anyways, let's get back to reading about <laughs> Mariah Carey. <laughs> You gotta love her because she don't make no sense at all. Um, all right. Let's see. And for those who've been asking about where did I get this big tarot deck, it's called the Giant Rider Weight Tarot Deck. And it's actually a priestess here in Atlanta that reads with these. And um, I've known her for a few years now, and I finally. She, she finally inspired me to just buy it and stuff like that. Um, it's really cool because it helps with your like readings and stuff. Yeah, I don't like. And we've also been having people asking us more about our um, oils. A lot of um, um, emails. I started using this oil, but here's our come to me oil. And if you can see where the real deal is filled with herbs essential oils and other things that I will not mention because <laughs> you don't want to give away all of your secrets um, so yeah guys and it comes it's really cute because it comes in this droplet very easy to use smells delicious yep so here's our come to me oil and here's our money oil. Munty. Munty. Munty oil. Mm, 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 good. <laughs> All right, guys. So, hope you guys got a good view of that. Um, so, what we're going to talk about is Nick Cannon and Mariah Carey. So, why don't we go to the cards and see. Um, I kind of want to work backwards I want to see how I hate how this camera is aimed the camera is all over the place today um I want to see how their relationship is right now so I'm working backwards I'm not going from the very beginning Nick Cannon Nick Cannon and Mariah Carey Nick Cannon and Mariah Carey I swear this camera is aimed like crazy I cannot fix it Nick Cannon and Mariah Carey Nick Cannon and Mariah Carey Nick Cannon and Mariah Carey five how do they feel about each other now five four three two one stop they're 
cool as long as they don't um, cross certain boundaries, especially Mariah, Mariah. She doesn't want certain boundaries crossed. She's kind of drawn a line at their relationship um, that they have. Um, so it's like they cool, they can kiki key, but there's certain things that he can't talk about and he can't really bring up with her. So she has drawn some type of boundary in the relationship. They're not, guys, a lot of people have been saying that they're getting back together. I more so feel healing. I feel healing um, or trying to bring up things of the actual past and trying to, um, for some reason, I feel like they're getting some type of counseling or getting some type of co-parenting counseling. Um, I feel it's something that actually Mariah, Mariah brought up and he actually said sure. He said sure. Um, it's funny because he thought sex would be involved in it, but I don't think he's seeing any sex. I don't think he's seeing any action. It's just more so of her coming to him and, you know, him still having a soft spot because he still does have a soft spot for her, even though he can't stand her ass. But, um, yeah, it's showing I'm trying to work, but it's still very foggy. It's like they're still at a point where they really they still fight about their views and point of views about how not really about parenting but just about things in the past so it's like attempting to heal but still not being able to meet or being able to um it's funny you would think it's Nick who's being the one who's trying to be peaceful but but it's actually Mariah she's the one who's actually trying to be peaceful but Nick is not necessarily trusting her all the way he thinks that she's up to something we all know that he's just had a baby with some chick so I'll see how Mariah feels about that like later on I don't know what her name is he's willing to give it a try he's willing to try to but I don't feel relationship I feel it's willing to try in building the relationship and moving forward and moving past heartache. I think they were still holding in a lot of um, weird, not so pleasant feelings about each other. And I think he was, he's, he's trying to move forward. He's trying to move forward. Also, it's funny because he is trying to get Mariah Carey to meet his new baby mama and Mar Mariah is like look with time you know I feel she's like with time not right now congratulations on your baby but not right now so he is trying to bring balance you know what's crazy guys I think they may actually film a reality show I think it's in talks. I felt that. I think they're going to try to talk about it and to start to film to profit off of their friendship. And the funny thing is, I think it's going to have a romantic edge to it, but I don't see them getting back together. It's kind of like they're cool. They're trying to stay cool. That they're trying to stay pleasant he's trying to move forward and it was really her who brought it up and he's trying to work towards it him and his baby mama are more than just friends I feel like he's telling Mariah something else I feel like he's 
thinking about starting a future with his baby mama I feel he's sitting down and he's thinking about it but he's being very secretive about it um he feels that life is very short and something about wanting to it's weird I don't see marriage I see them living together or having some type of you know co-parenting where they live together it's kind of like it is a relationship but he's not looking to get married um Mariah Carey he feels she acts like she's oblivious and that drives him crazy it's like she's oblivious but still throwing shade at the same time and still saying like little um shady things um and things of that sort he doesn't want another man in his territory he doesn't want another man um raising his son um for for some when it comes to this new woman so she is coming up in their reading no there is no reconciliation for them i've been hearing He's moving past that. He's just trying to make things as pleasant as he can. Because I think him and that baby mama are going to, to, to try to make things work. Again, I don't see marriage. I don't see him wanting to marry her. But I do feel that he's trying to work things through. And he's trying to get Mariah to a more balanced of accepting it so I almost feel he's playing nice because of the new baby because he doesn't want her to find out you know without him kind of already having to calm her down um so no I heard a lot of people say that they're still screwing each other and things of that sort I'm not seeing that I'm seeing two people who are working on trying to move forward and trying on making things work and she wants to profit off of it she wants them to do something with that yes yeah, in talks it's in talks they may have a reality show about that isn't that interesting? Very interesting. I don't know who the new baby mama. I hate having to look stuff up, guys. I'm about to type in nick cannon's baby mama why is this phone only on six percent but it's been charging for over an hour no comment <laughs> oh my god <sighs> y'all this is taking forever <sighs> nick cannon baby mama <laughs> Brittany Bell okay how does Mariah Carey feel about Brittany Bell how does Mariah Carey feel about Brittany Bell how does Mariah Carey feel about Britney Bell. Mariah Carey and 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 Britney Bell. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Because the music game made me happy. You know, yeah. Okay. Um. She most definitely is very emotional about it, y'all. She's not very happy about it. Um, she thinks that greed is a part of it. She feels that, you know, she's just doing it for money. Like, um, she has a joke that she tells about Britney, like, 
Britney broke or Britney no pockets. It's something about something about her not having money or something of that sort. Like, like how does she live? Like it's it's almost like Mariah Carey's like, how does she live? Like Mariah sees her as like a poor person, as like, bitch, how how did you survive all these years without Nick Cannon's assistance? funny but I almost feel like Brittany wanted to reach out to Mariah but um Nick would not really allow it I feel she wanted to post something on Instagram or social media but Nick Nick kind of like has a lot of control over her he does like he really does and it's like he was like if I were you I wouldn't do that that would not be very wise like Mariah sees her as like poor I don't know how to explain it it's like she's not worth my time it's like she's poor it's like that's literally what I'm hearing it's like a pauper who got pregnant with a princess child it's it's literally a waste of time it's almost comical to her like you could have impregnated all types of women but you chose a nobody like it's it's funny it's almost like i i can almost hear her laughing nick is also very like defensive about it um he's very d defensive he he tries to protect britney he doesn't really it's weird but i feel britney wants to reach out to mariah but he's not trying to have that right now this is crazy y'all but she may end up having a second child she may end up having a second child excuse me um he's trying to see where this is he, he's not sure y'all where it's going to go um he's not sure but he's building her something or he's about to put her in something he's about to put in a really like nice house like somewhere nice somewhere like 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 luxurious somewhere where she's gonna be comfortable and stuff like that yeah and I just see Mariah it's funny to her it's like it's an inside joke like Britney poor pockets or something it's like a little saying she has about Britney like that that bro bitch okay like okay <laughs> I'm sorry y'all that, that's what she's saying how does Britney Bell feel about Mariah Carey <laughs> like broke bitches I don't need no frauds like how does Britney Bell feel about Mariah Carey? How does Britney Bell feel about Mariah Carey? How does Britney Bell feel about Mariah Carey? Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Um, eggshells. Like walking on eggshells, but she'll say that it's not really a big deal and that she doesn't care. But for some reason, she has a fear that Mariah Carey can cause her to have problems in the industry. Um, she doesn't think Mariah's a very friendly person. Not very friendly. Not very impressionable. Um, she feels like M Mariah in some way has blocked her money. Something is coming up from the past, y'all. I think Mariah had kind of black listed her or made her not be able to move up but this is while she was married to nick she, she threw some type of shade or something where she kind of blocked britney from actually being able to do some stuff so there is some shade like she feels like mariah's always hovering above them um she is most definitely about to hook up with nick Yeah, Mariah has done some stuff to block her money. 
or to make opportunities harder for her. Y'all, have y'all ever had a damn bra and you had to take out the damn wire from out your bra? This was poking the shit out of my ass. Like, I just could not fucking take it. I just pulled it out. But yeah, she feels like Mariah is hovering above her head. But it's funny because she wants to find a way to profit off of this. She does. Nick is taking care of her and the baby. Yep, same cards. Trying to protect her, trying to move on with her. Um, yep, Nick is protecting her a lot from kind of like Mariah's wrath. But I see Mariah kind of like, <laughs> that broke bitch. <laughs> she gonna die broke. Like, it's just this, this, okay. You know, like, she had a dream. <laughs> like, she's like, whatever. Like, but Mar Mariah did do some cop blocking, like, with her career. What about Brittany Bell and Nick Cannon? Brittany Bell and Nick Cannon. Brittany Bell and Nick Cannon. Brittany Bell and, and, and Nick Cannon. Five, four, three, two one stop I only have four minutes this shit sucks let me hurry up and see she wants more but he's not willing to give her more he wants to be with her but on his own recognizance is that the word y'all like he wants to be with her and there's love y'all that there's feelings there like he may front like I'm just her baby daddy you know but there's most definitely feelings there but Nick is not going to make any major moves he's gonna be with her but it's almost like it doesn't have a title it's like it's very weird it's very weird and it's very tiring to her but he's there for her if she needs anything if the baby needs anything he's there it's almost this um i'm there i will help you know where i can i will be the best man that i can to you and your child but at the same time he's gonna yeah he's gonna treat her well y'all he's gonna treat her well he really is um they will be in some sort of romantic relationship they gonna be fucking they gonna be sucking but it's kind of like p diddy and cassie it's like you know they're together but it took 20 years for him to crown her with some type of title you see what i'm saying it feels like that but yeah he loves her but he just doesn't know where where it's like it's missing a title y'all so us speaking in terms of like Mariah Carey and Nick Cannon no but they are going through some type of therapy to try to get along um I want to go to the jumbo cards and I want to ask about what's in the future for Mariah Carey five four three two one stop um Mariah Carey is about to go into another relationship where she's going to profit off of it yeah but she's working on a lot of new projects new things like she's something is coming up in Europe or something she's gonna do that's gonna be seen in Europe it's not here in the states it feels like Europe um she's working on multiple projects y'all she she's not she's not sleeping she's not sleeping there's another romantic relationship coming but it will not last and he's younger 
he's younger too he's younger um love love a secret love um a passionate type of love she may not ever expose him either it may stay in the dark it's weird it feels very quick it feels very quick it's like here today gone tomorrow but for some reason i feel it's going to make some type of publicity yeah y'all she's she's still about to find somebody else like she's not about to um wait on anything she's gonna do some type of concert almost like a world tour or a tour in europe something of that sort is coming up all right guys thank you for watching and have a wonderful day bye bye